Lord Horatio Herbert Kitchener was my great-great-grandmother's cousin, who served in the British military and was a prominent figure in South African history, specifically the Boer War, where he imitated strategies like the concentration camps to force Boer commandos to comply. He also organized the largest volunteer army Britain had ever seen during World War I. Kitchener, with all his might, defended the British Empire and ultimately empowered the ideological beliefs of white supremacy without knowing or even dreaming that he would one day have a great, great niece who is biracial. He later died in 1916 after a ship he was on sank. The outcome of Kitchener's supreme rule is rather ironic. He must be turning in his grave knowing that his bloodline is mixed with African blood. His legacy as a colonial ruler is remembered through storytelling and memorial sites. I come from a historical background of relatives serving in the military, including my great-grandfather, Lance Davies. Being in the military has been viewed as a privilege for serving your country and is considered to be a job for masculine white males. However, with the transition to a new world, this concept has changed. The South African National Defence Force has become the most racially integrated workspace and ultimately serves a democratic South Africa. This goes beyond what my ancestors could ever have imagined. Taking my history into consideration, it is understandable as to why I have always wanted to be a policewoman, because this idea of serving my country has been genetically imprinted in me. This part of my history is very significant, because it has shaped my identity and who I have become. I realize that I am who I am and I exist because of resistance against colonial rule and oppressive systems. I pondered the thought whether he would feel betrayed by his family who did not continue the family traditions and practices that he once upheld, or if he would accept the outcome of this reality. I will admit though, there are some similarities between Kitchener and I. We are both Cancerians as our birthdays are in June, therefore we may have similar personality traits, ambition, drive and loyalty. But contrary to Kitchener, who just wanted to conquer, I believe I have good intentions and I am sympathetic to all. One thing is for sure, our hopes and aspirations are very different. I can't deny my history. I can only accept it for what it really is. As Jimmy Dean once said, I can't change the direction of wind, but I can adjust my sails to always reach my destination.